Hello and welcome to this session and in this session we shall understand as to how you need to answer this important HR interview question. Why did you choose engineering as your profession? Well, it's such an important question to which you cannot obviously answer that your neighbor recommended you to take up engineering or your elder cousins recommended you or your distant uncles and aunts recommended you to take up engineering. Obviously, that cannot be your answer. What really the answer should be is something that we shall discuss in this session. But then the same question may also be asked like this. What motivated you to pursue a career in engineering? Or the same question may also be posed to you in this manner that what influenced your choice to enter the field of engineering or you may be questioned this way as to how did you decide that engineering was the right profession for you or the same question may be asked in any of these ways but then irrespective of the manner in which the interviewer is asking you this question basically through this question what the interviewer wants to know is as to what motivated you to take up engineering as your profession so let me proceed and tell you as to how you need to answer this question even before i tell you as to how you need to answer this question what is more important for you is to understand as to why this question is being posed to you well one thing that you need to remember is that the field of engineering appeals to those who have a strong inclination towards solving intricate problems and discovering creative solutions after all engineering necessitates a solid technical background well through this question the interviewer wants to assess your technical prowess and determine if you possess the aptitude required for the engineering profession through this the interviewer aims to evaluate your level of passion for this aspect and determine if you hold a genuine interest towards the field of engineering that way engineering programs are known for their rigorous nature which prompts the interviewer to inquire about how your academic background aligns with the demands of the profession. Well, the interviewers are particularly interested in understanding your chosen engineering branch or your engineering specialization and its connection to your inherent interest. Expressing your personal fascination with the field of engineering can showcase your dedication and enthusiasm to the profession, illustrating your genuine commitment to engineering. After all, engineering provides diverse career opportunities across numerous industries. Through this question, the interviewers are seeking to determine your awareness of the potential career paths within the field and assess whether you have conducted a thorough research to make informed decisions regarding your career progression trajectory. Well, through this question, the interviewer also wants to assess whether you possess the required qualities, the required skill set, the required approach and the required attitude and whether you can really apply them effectively to solve real world problem scenarios. One important aspect that is associated with engineering is that it holds the power to create meaningful societal impact through technological advancements and innovative solutions. Through this question, the interviewer would be trying to assess your aspiration to contribute towards a positive change and evaluate your capacity for creative thinking and emphasize your potential to drive innovation in their company. <laughs> well, that way, if you can provide a valid explanation as to why you chose engineering as your profession and also if you can explain and reveal to them your long-term career goals in the field, then definitely you would impress the interviewer and maybe you can bag your dream job in that company as well. All said and done, engineering is a dynamic field 
that undergoes constant evolution demanding professionals to stay updated about the latest technologies and the industry trends. Well, through this question, the interviewer may also be seeking to evaluate your capability to collaborate and work effectively in a team and also be able to communicate complex concepts with ease and finally contribute to the collective goal of the company. So, any of these could be the possible reasons as to why this question is being posed to you in your interview but then how really should you answer this question <laughs> let me explain i shall indeed communicate to you as to how you need to approach and answer this important hr interview question but then even before that what is more important for you to understand is as to what are the common mistakes that are normally committed by the fresh job seekers while answering this important HR interview question. Well, one such common mistake is to express negativity towards other non-engineering choices. Well, it is crucial to avoid speaking negatively about other professions or trying to belittle other professions in your response. Instead, what you have to focus is on highlighting the positive aspects associated with engineering and what is it that in engineering that specifically attracts you to the field. Emphasize the unique opportunities, the unique challenges and the unique personal fulfillment that engineering offers you without criticizing or undermining any other alternative career paths. Another commonly committed mistake is about exaggerating or giving fabricated answers as to why one has chosen engineering as a profession. Well, one thing you need to understand is that the interviewers are extremely smart in detecting your dishonesty and hence I recommend you to not give any exaggerated or fabricated answers. It is essential for you to maintain honesty and genuineness in your response so that you can build trust and establish credibility. By providing sincere and authentic reasons for choosing engineering, you can effectively convey your genuine interest and passion for the field and through this you can foster a positive impression with the interviewer. Another mistake that is normally committed by the freshers while answering this question is that they have chosen engineering because engineering as a field offers great monetary benefits. Well, it is a known fact that engineering as a field definitely provides excellent earning potential but then placing excessive emphasis only on the monetary benefits of the field as the sole reason for you to choose engineering as your profession may actually convey a materialistic mindset. It is important for you to showcase a genuine interest in the field that goes beyond the financial considerations and what you really need to highlight is your passion and intrinsic motivation for pursuing engineering rather than giving over emphasis on the monetary benefits involved with the profession. Another aspect that you should keep in mind while answering this question is to not over generalize your answer. Well, merely making broad statements without providing specific examples can result in a generic and an unremarkable answer. Instead, what you should be focusing on is to provide specific instances or share personal experiences that vividly illustrate your genuine interest and an unwavering commitment to the field of engineering. This approach shall definitely add depth and authenticity to your response and through this you can make your HR interview more engaging and memorable for the interviewer. All said and done, while answering this question, it is important for you to align your answer with the job requirements and the skills essential for that particular position. Neglecting to make this connection can convey the impression to the interviewer that you haven't thoroughly considered the role you are going to be playing in the company. <laughs> Therefore, it's important for you to demonstrate as to how your motivations and interests directly correlate with the responsibilities and the skill sets required for the specific engineering role. <laughs> well, that way, any of these could be the common mistakes that are normally committed by the freshers while answering this important HR interview question and now that you are aware of it, I am sure you shall not be committing the same mistakes again. Well, my 5 tips for you to answer this important HR interview question are these. So, I am sure that in this session, you have indeed understood as to 
how you need to approach and answer this important HR interview question. Well, that way, if you need to find answers to more such important HR interview questions and hence prepare well for your HR interview, then all that you need to do is to continue watching this video series. Thanks for watching. Let's meet again in my next session.